Hey guys and welcome back to my channel as you all seen by the title i'm just going to be showing you how to take my business pictures but i just wanted to show you all a super quick clip of me getting ready i think it's super important to feel confident when you're taking pictures especially of yourself um for your business page and stuff so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video so as y'all see by the title of the video your girl is giving you all a video on how i take pictures for my business page i just honestly suck i try my best to try and stay on top of my content but i, I just suck like literally every picture i've taken for my business i've done by myself and y'all ask me how i take product pictures so I'm just showing y'all a little bit. Today in general, I'm just going to try and take a few different um, pictures. I have a few different ideas behind clothing. That's what I'm starting off with just because I feel like that includes my face. So I had to make sure like my hair looks as fresh. I kind of want to try and take a picture of me like in my robe at my desk. Just like working on stuff just because like that's the vibe. That's literally what I do all the time. So I kind of want to give a picture that just shows that, you know, some good, good tips that I just learned about yesterday and that I'm going to start to uh use in my business okay my issue with posting content is just that i feel overwhelmed by it then i kind of forget to do it that you can use something called later gram and that will schedule your post for you you can use something called garney that will plan your feed out so it make sure your layout makes sense use something called unsplash for stock images you can use lightroom to edit images if anybody has the same struggles as me honey make sure y'all use those apps because that's what i'm about to do to get more consistent with my posting to hopefully like better my sales and things like that. Can you tell me I'm cute like 10 times in a row? Oh, you cute, 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 you cute. Okay, so y'all put on the flash, I turn on a timer, three seconds, cause 10 can be too long. I'm gonna actually put y'all on the stand. Okay, here we go. See how that turned out. Ooh, kind of fire, but my background just looked dirty. Let me clean up. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we're going to try a few different poses. Oh, this lighting not hitting the same for some reason. But these pictures better. I'm mad. Okay. Y'all, so this is a struggle of trying to take some pictures. Now, this is like clothing pictures. Of course, it's different with like accessories and stuff. I'm probably going to take like two more, two, three more pictures in this dress. Set that timer. Okay, y'all, so I finished up in this dress. And by the way, today is January 7th. I was talking to one of my subscribers today. And I was telling her I was going to tell y'all about her business on my vlog. I went to her business page and I really, really like her content. So her name on Instagram is Shy, S-H-Y, Beauty, B-A-U-T-Y, Cosmetics. Y'all know how to spell cosmetics. I just felt like her layout was super, super cute. And it just had a good flow. Should I go ahead and check her out? The next look I'm about to try to go for is like a just an entrepreneur shoot. Just like a chill, like you know at the desk type of vibe so i have y'all set up right there my desk is behind me in shot as y'all can see i'm about to go ahead and grab my laptop there's multiple ways you can do this um selfie sticks and things like that but usually the one that i use to take my pictures i'm using for y'all like because i have a tripod that twists onto the camera but then also has a piece that can twist on top of it and work as like a selfie stick as well so i would just have my phone up there taking pictures you know if it's like jewelry i just use my hands to take pictures back camera of course but with the way that the lighting is set up in my room this is the way i'm gonna have to take it like i'm gonna have to try and take it with this in the background and me like on my i don't know we're gonna figure it out y'all know how a tripod has two legs behind and one leg up front so i'm sitting my phone right here let me check and see if i like the angle and background so this is what it looks like so the lighting like i mentioned might it looks bad but this is potential because you can edit you can edit so i'm about to try it again i noticed that my door is open so i move that and also my snow brush i'm gonna move out the way too because we don't want any of that so i don't like the way my hair looks so i'm gonna brush my hair out because although i'm chilling you still want to look cute because you want people to be like oh like she looks cute Oh, I look dumb. I'm trying to smile right there. That one's okay. That one I was trying to show my dimple too hard. <laughs> well, I like this one. But. I 
mean, that one's cool. I was going to say, but I don't like the angle of my desk that it has. I really like this angle of my desk the most. And this one was the cutest. But I didn't like my hair and my door was open. But out of those pictures, I'm about to choose three. Okay? Three that I like and that I'm going to use. I'm going to edit as well. I don't think I should keep this one or get rid of it. Keep it for now. This one is definitely has a lot of potential. So, I'm going to start my editing process see what it's hitting for i weeded out all the pictures that i won't be using so far in the dress picture as well as the desk shot i only have 30 minutes until i have to leave for work by the way now y'all know i always keep it real with y'all my hardest thing right now is taking pictures of lip glosses so i'm about to try to do it and see if i'm successful if i'm not sorry okay so y'all see i have my lip glosses here on my white fur and in perspective like i'm literally just right in front of my mirror because i need the lighting i'm going to grab my phone and we're gonna go for this so this is how we look now another trick that i learned from i think it was either bougie baby or kyla shea was the power of brightening and dimming so i think about here it looks good looks okay okay so the saturation made the snowflakes stick out really well so I like that all right so this is an array of lip glosses so let's try and take pictures of this So I told y'all I'm honestly not good at the whole lip gloss thing. Figured I would give it a try for y'all. And for my entrepreneurs, I know a lot of you sell lip gloss. Please give me some tips on taking pictures of lip glosses. It's so hard to me. Like, I don't know why. But So next, we're going to try a jewelry piece. Okay, y'all. So this is day two. As y'all can tell, my hair look different. Outfit look different. Life is different. But um, yesterday, I had to end the vlog because had to go to work like I told y'all so but I think I ended off saying that the last thing that we we're gonna do was jewelry so we're about to get into that so of course I already have all of my pictures taken for my jewelry and stuff but I'm just gonna give y'all an example so I'm not gonna lie me taking pictures of like my tennis bracelets was so hard because um I don't know it's a bracelet so it was just hard the earrings were really really easy I'm trying to right now I'm just trying to figure out what I want to show y'all a picture of and then I'm gonna bring out some rings I think okay what I'm gonna do actually is take a picture of because shout out to you Angela um she bought she bought some she bought a silver tennis bracelet and a ring and I'm like, oh my goodness, they look so pretty together. So I'm about to take a picture of the earrings, a ring, and a tennis bracelet, like, all together. And, like, side of the box that I shipped them out in. And we're going to see, like, how bomb it looks. And, yeah, so that's going to be that. And then, lastly, honestly, y'all, the best thing that I've taken a picture of so far have been my freaking sunglasses. I'm going to go ahead and insert a picture of how it looks. And it's just so bomb like and i'm gonna show y'all what i used um to like kind of dress the picture up and i might dress this jewelry picture up as well so i'm just gonna show y'all how that turns out because of vibe and vibing and as far i'm trying to think if i'm gonna do any more shots and clothes because i did that one dress i might well i think i am gonna take a picture of myself inside of my gray jumpsuit just because i've never posted a picture in that at all and i need to so I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture in that and I'm also going to I'm not gonna take a picture in my my knitted dresses yet just because I have some pictures in them already I don't love them but yeah I just don't feel like taking a picture in those so that's what the plan is for right now I'm about to go ahead and get everything set up okay so as stated I got everything set up this is just my box and this I'm using like a messed up box just because this is just for you know video purposes only earrings ring jewels in here now my jewels i have used before i use them for my sunglasses mostly but look at them 
And for the a million time, another thing that I usually use, especially in situations like jewelry, is my ring light. But let me show y'all how it's broken. Like, y'all can't probably tell. But it comes on, but it's like a weird, dim, like, purple type of light. But I'm going to still try to use it, though, honestly, because it might not be bad. Um, so, yeah. Let me go ahead and grab my phone. Got my phone, my light, my box, my jewelry. So first thing I'm gonna do, let me bring y'all down. Bring y'all perspective down. All right, this is me holding the light up. First thing I'm about to go ahead and do is open up the jewelry. But these are earrings. This is a ring. And this is a bracelet. So super cute set together because everything's silver and everything's like blingy. I'm going to show y'all. So we just about to flick it up. Okay. Then another thing that we can do, like I said, is spice it up. Add a few little pink jewels in there, right? So let me go ahead and set everything up like I want it. Okay, so this is the setup I came up with. The jewels may be unnecessary, but we gonna see. So, as always, I have my phone out. Let me move this from the back. See if I need any brightness or anything like that. I kind of like that. And I want flash, so. Let me put that flash on there. I feel like with jewelry, it's always important to have flash, so. I think I'm gonna like that put that down put that brightness up so this is what the picture looks like without any edits or anything so this is just about placement and jewels and then at this point we can start to edit I don't think I like the way I took these pictures because you don't get a good view of the ring so hold up <clears throat> So basically what ended up happening in the last clip is I ended up running out of memory as I was filming and I did not realize it so I was like filming me trying to take um, really good pictures of the jewelry set for a long time and it just like basically didn't happen because I wasn't filming but I didn't know. Let me just go ahead and explain how I take good jewelry pictures. Number one I think it's super important to have really 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 good lighting like good lighting is super important it just shows how the product looks in its best light just like how when you take pictures for yourself you want to show yourself in your best light kind of just want to do the same thing for your products as well a really good setup and if it's like a picture with you you want like a good background look edits are like hit or miss i feel like it depends on the product on whether or not you want to edit it or not that was pretty much everything so i hope this video was helpful for y'all i went ahead and just kind of showed y'all how i break down my video as always go ahead and comment down below video ideas in the comment sections and thoughts and things like that because as y'all can see I'm actually taking you all's like um video requests so i'm gonna stop talking i just want to say happy sunday to everybody thank you for watching if you haven't already make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button like this video comment down below go ahead and go to my website www.crowncollectionswiththez.com and make a purchase small or big everything's appreciated and i will see you guys in my next video bye uh, black y'all and i'm black y'all and i'm blacker than black and i'm black y'all and i'm black y'all and i'm black y'all and i'm blacker than black and i'm black y'all i'm black